What is up guys, we're back for another episode of Life is Strange. Continuing hmm. on, trying to figure out These how to get These are thick in tracks and definitely fresh. Nathan's SUV? And we're continuing on finding clues about how, what happened that night between Nathan, Kate, and Mr. Frank. Yeah, we must look around. Take a photo of the bird. I'm on the right track with the, these photos on the side. Let's move this. Is there a hole? Bingo! Chloe! I found the front door! Come on! Oh yes! Maximus rules! God, this is way too Blair Witch. I have goosebumps <laughs> all over. Come on, Supermax. Hey, check out this old chest! A little louder, Chloe. Jeez, that is ancient. Jackpot. Old shit. No, look closer. Harry Aaron Prescott and family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. The Prescott's bring bomb shelter boom to town. Nice scrapbook. You search for more clues and I'll scope out the area. <clears throat> Detective. Yes, old Prescott clippings. But that can't be the only thing here. I don't think so either. This tractor has paid its dues. It's again the tracks. Okay, there's no reason for anybody to drive out here. But there must be. There gotta be I something here. I guess the here. Prescotts were just born bastards. Wow, sir. Talk about home on the range. Literally. <laughs> rusty There's old no button. way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Old, old. <sighs> Nothing here. I felt something ought to be. So many haystacks, so few needles. So many haystacks, so few needles. Wow, oh, that's not even gonna give me a choice to look at it. No more secrets, Sean Prescott. Chloe would make a great detective too. Mm. What am I missing here? There goes the ground again. Nothing here. Bingo. It has to be this one. Just rotting wood. Are you kidding me? Okay, pitchfork. If a zombie shows up, I have my weapon. Huh. These hooks are used to lift haystacks. I... Saw them in a Friday the 13th movie. Scope out the perimeter, Max. There has to be more here than this crate. I swear there's something underground. Whoa. Bingo. What is this? I have no. It's totally clue. brand new. Why? Great. Great. Ah, the good old days. Ding, ring. Dead 
God, I can no, just open Super it. Max. You can't open this with your bare hands. Maybe with. Oh. Okay, I Chloe. See what you're doing. I, I found some kind of hatch, but it's locked. I got this. I hope. Let me know the second you need any help. All right, and I, I think the, I just pushed the button, right? Oh. Platform. Hold on. Climb up. Chloe. Can you give me a hand? Sidekick at your service. Right. Up and away, Supermax. I dig having minions. Okay. There's a stepping stool. Pull this rope without tearing my flesh off. I need to hook this up to something heavier. Well, like hey, that's all we're surrounded by. Wait a minute. Oh, photo. I won't. There's an owl in here, surprisingly. My owl. What are you doing over here? Good evening, Doctor Who. <laughs> Sorry. Just now noticed you. Looks sturdy enough to stand on. Yeah, one would think. So I need something sturdy to keep it on. So many haystacks, so few needles. I just climb up there again, but I need something heavy. What am I? What am I gonna find that's heavy? Oh. Damn, pliers. those pliers are fossilized. I need something strong to smash this padlock. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. <laughs> I would have thought, huh? The tracks, the crate. I guess the Prescotts were just born bastards. Uh, maybe going outside might help. And I'll keep looking. Can't use Pretty the Pretty sure this old pitchfork won't open a padlock. Try again, Max. Damn, lots of info here. I don't think there's anything else in here that can help me. I gotta go out. There's gotta be something here. Oh, car. Watson, we can safely assume that this ancient vehicle is not our suspect. I don't think it is either. However, what's that? Now, why would somebody run all that electricity into an old empty barn? I don't want to go that way. Uh, I wasn't trying to go all the way out there. Watch us. Need something heavy, but what? What am I gonna use? I 
doesn't give me any other options here. Maybe I missed something. What is it though? Something heavy to pull it down. The only thing in here is in is hey, and it's not letting me use it. Mm. <laughs> My other thing up here is. Uh, Here's the other end of the rope. Yeah, I see that. But how am I supposed to get it down? What do I do? What do There's I do? There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Now, what do you suggest we do? I can't use the pitchfork. There's nothing over there. It's just a photo here. Wow, sir. Talk about home on the range. Then another photo here. And the tractor. This tractor has paid its dues. But there's nothing else. Pliers won't work. So what am I what am I missing here? I think I would figure this out. I just can't put my finger on it. So many haystacks, so few needles. That's just gonna keep telling me that. I have to get through this monster padlock for... Ah, the good old days. If only there was more stuff up here. I'm not seeing anything. I really am. I'm not. I'm stuck. I really am. Damn, those pliers are fossilized. I need something strong to. Smash this padlock. But there's nothing else strong around us. That's the thing. I don't see anything else up here. Just the owl and the rope. That's it. That looks sturdy enough to stand on. No more secrets, Sean Prescott. Thick tracks and definitely fresh. Nathan's SUV?
Yeah, one would think there would be more. But I'm not seeing anything that I can move or anything. Therefore, I am in a loop. Go about the perimeter, Max. There has to be more here than this crate. you know. Oh. There, has, there is one thing I haven't tried. Makes sense now. Gotcha. You motor scooter. The one thing I didn't think of. Man, I feel so silly. Oh, so that didn't work at all. didn't work at all. Okay, gotta get back up here. But use the rope this time. Bingo. Gotcha. And now pull it. It should do it. Ring. Ring. Max Giver strikes again. Whew. I did it. I just wasn't, I was thinking everything except this, the one thing that I've been doing this whole time. Oh, I wish Warren lock. could have seen that physics trick. Alright, let's see what's in here. Damn, this is heavy. What is this? Jackpot. Do I even need to say how weird this is? It's it pretty weird, all things considered. Who built this kind of place? A press god, of course. With all that money, I'm not surprised. Let's see what they're hiding. This bunker is so surreal. This is too heavy to break, so I'll need a code. 
What's the code? First a padlock, then a digicode? Someone really doesn't want... want visitors. Hmm. Maybe the code is on one of these... One of these papers up here. I guess the Prescotts were just born bastards. I need three numbers or letters. Wow, sir. Talk about home on the range. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. Serious door. Where's Gandalf when I need him? Oh, no, it didn't work. Ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. Come on. They were preparing for this, I think. I also they have all this stuff here. More survivalist supplies. Look at these cans. David must shop at the same store. Water supplies. It's like in David's garage bunker. This says it all about Nathan. He needs help. Huh. Duct tape in a bunker is always a bad sign. They were here to torture somebody. What's with the Prescott's and creepy art? I guess Nathan needs the most expensive printer in the world. Son of a bitch. One? Hold on. It's not one million, is it? No. Wait. Yes, it is. 1.3 million. On a bunker. Jeez. Talk about tortured. Jesus, I already hate this place. Okay, what's this letter? Oh yeah, school suspension is a deal breaker in the Prescott family. Okay, let's look on here. Let's see what's in here. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh no. my god. They did tire up here. Tortured her somehow. Whoa. 
What is going on between Nathan and his father? Everything is sketchy as fuck. Nothing about Rachel here. Ah, the Apocalypse Entertainment System. <laughs> That's an original signed illustration. Fits perfect in here. Okay, let's look here. Somebody likes their whiskey. The Prescott's in creepy art. Mm hmm These newspapers are all about Rachel and Kate. Needles and drugs. Needles. Gross. This must be the crap that Nathan gets from Frank. Look at all this weird shit. So who's using this fancy tripod? Somebody who takes pictures. I mean, really. I've never takes seen pictures. so much pricey equipment before. Can you imagine chilling in this room? No, I cannot. Not one bit. Cupboard. Whoa, Rachel and Kate. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. We are. Okay, got a binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Look, the next one says Kate. Oh no, Kate. No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. Ugh. Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning the dose search tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. This can't be real. These are all, these are all post shots, right? Right? Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe, maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard! Max, we have to find that spot now! Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way! She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. This picture is framed different. Rachel is awake and fucking furious. Rachel has passed out. And she has something in her mouth. What happened to her? This shot is so staged. I, I, I can't believe it's real. I can't. Oh yeah, school suspension is a deal breaker in the Prescott family. Kate looks so doped up. She has no idea she's being posed. At least Kate was asleep through all this bullshit. These guys are monsters. And those sheep's clothing. Oh, that son of a bitch. You gotta go. These Prescotts have got to be stopped. to be here. Chloe, slow down! Wait for me! I know exactly where I'm going! What do you mean you know exactly where you're going?
Look, this is it. This is it. Are you gonna help me, Max? Chloe, stop. Look. Please, no. Oh. That smell. Rachel. Oh. This was just more, this was more than just a bunker, this, this is a chamber to torture people. Dope them up and take pictures of them. How sick people do that. Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is gonna get in my way. Especially with your help. Right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. gonna do kill him what would that really solve oh shit this is like that eclipse you're right look at the outline I can't tell if they're different what is that it can't be too much Jesus Chloe look up at the sky Possible. beautiful I don't give a shit the world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. You're not listening. There's two moons. Why are there two moons? Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you all right after today? I'm glad you stopped me. Nathan is dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? <laughs> well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm a pain in the booty. Just one picture. Uh. Action. Picture. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra violence. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey. We still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. 
I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. <laughs> Not to me. <sighs> wow. Only half a drink does that to him. Sheesh. I can see he has not built up a tolerance, which is a good thing. Hi, can I take your phone or anything? <sighs> no, I didn't see any tablet with cat pics. Okay, Chloe, where the hell are you? Ugh, I hate ditching all these clothes. It is kind of fast. Plus, some of the Vortex Club always give me attitude. Stella, that's what they're here for. Uh, hi, Stella. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. What girl? She had blue hair, dressed like a punk. Oh, I've seen her putting up those Rachel Amber posters. I'm stuck here, so I'm sorry I can't help you. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Job? Who hired you? Mr. Jefferson asked me because he knows I don't have a lot of money, even with my job and scholarship. I'm not cool enough for this school. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I, I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. All right, thank you. Vortex party is in the, in the swimming pool. <laughs> Guess I'm not too Come on, why is it always Alyssa? No. What? Alyssa, Get out of the way. For yourself. Why? When I have Max Caulfield at my side. Good luck. Thanks. Ah, uh, the wit of the Vortex Club. What would a shitty party be without glow sticks? <laughs> am I right or am I right? Oh, I'm so not impressed by this VIP crap. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? Sorry, but I'm on the list. Okay? Okay. I know that Max Caulfield is not on any list for the Vortex Club. Nice try. Listen. No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. Drinking everything. It's 
Not anymore. Drink more later. Um, can't actually like look at it. Like, oh wait, hold on. Photo. There we go. I'm not in the mood, but still, this could be an interesting shot. <laughs> There's that skeleton one. I was looking for. Bam. I got almost every single one. I'm looking for the the moon one in the, the window now. So it should be too long. Justin's just a little buzz. Yo, maximum overdrive. About time you got here to save this lame rave. Wanna get ripped? Uh, you look pretty ripped already, Justin. Yeah. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is here. She's not with me. So yes, this party sucks. Have you seen Nathan? Speaking of, have you seen Nathan? Oh, he should be freaking out in the VIP lounge with that whore tex club. Fucking hate those snobby douchebags. Especially Nathan. That dude is gonna go on a rampage soon. You might be right, so stay away from him tonight, okay? Spread the word. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. And your voice sounds different. You okay? How about a quick dab? Uh, no, I'm, I'm cool, Justin. And I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus. You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to get my board and grind. The tide is turning. I'd like to tear every one of these things down. Kill the Chloe Prescott. must be around. Yep. Already? Yes, you Gross. How did this even get here? Somebody's either having sex or throwing up. Or both. Good night, sweet prince. Coming in, sister. This is clearly not the way in. Just a bathroom. I'm gonna have to get it on soon. Be here tonight. Okay, hold on. I have to go to the movie room. Mm -hmm. What up? Oh my god. 
Max, seriously, what are you doing here? Taylor, have you seen Nathan yet? If I did, it's none of your business. This is a VIP area, so you should get back to the booth. Mm. Just keep on dancing for Victoria, Taylor. And stay away from Nathan. Like, thanks for your concern. At least I won't. Surprise, Hayden is trashed. What's up, Hayden? Oh, look. Up in the sky, it's Super Max here to save the party. Have you seen Nathan? I just vaped some dank OG buds, so I can barely see you. Or are these hotties next to me? You want a hit? Uh, nope. No. I want to find Nathan. Me too! He's supposed to be bringing some special party favors. I hope at the party you actually planned a party at the party. Not this week. So, has anybody here seen Nathan? I guess you have to go ask everybody here. Or, you could sit down and take a quick hit. What about Victoria? Yeah, go ask her yourself. I would, but like I said, I'm fucking ripped. Maybe you better take it easy tonight. Whatever. I'm in this world to have fun. Try it sometime, Max. I finally get you and Dana to come out to a vortex club party, but you just want to lecture me? Gee, thanks, Mr. Madsen. How much fun did Kate have at your last party? Listen, Hayden. Just watch out for Nathan tonight. I think that's your job, Max. Come back when you're ready to go. She's wasted, and nobody is looking out for her. Nobody learns at Blackwell. Yeah, she is out. <laughs> K.O. I think my goal is very powerful. That oxygen kit might come in handy if somebody binges. That would be wicked. Uh, did you hear something? I'm Chips and crackers. Spare no expense for it. I know Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. Her? Look, man. Even after all the stuff she she's done, she does deserve to get born. Hey. Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Wait. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, me, Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cared she was so wasted. It's a fucking party. Everybody is wasted. What do you want from me? Some humanity, Victoria. Well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so you should be happy. And I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. This is bigger than a problem, child. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. Uh, you have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. On point, Max. Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think I always do. I don't either, but that's the choice you make. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fake we're not supposed to be friends? Not enemies. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, 
I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's gonna happen. But not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. I'm gonna warn her. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your friend, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. Oh, sure he it's not. He treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. Deadly? I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, but cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from him, and stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time, and I have other people I can go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um, text me if you need anything. I will. Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. I do. I she found a way here. Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria. Yeah. I'm glad I warned her. I hope she's okay. Oh good, Chloe's here. Well, she obviously didn't find Nathan. That... Can I talk to you for a second? Max, all right. I'll talk after you shake that food. Oh, uh, no. Have you seen Nathan? I can't even get Victoria or Taylor to twerk. And you want to hang with Nathan? Why? Business. You should talk to his dad then. Bro has got more money than God, and he spends it on the Vortex Club, not the losers over there in the cheap seats. Logan, this is a swimming pool. In other words, you haven't seen Nathan. Ask Victoria. She always knows where he is. Don't you ever want to see him? You're so cute. We never really talk. Talk about <laughs> what's there what? to talk about? The next Bigfoot's game. We could go out to the field. I could show you some moves. Give you a touchdown. Logan, don't make me hurt. Damn. That was way more exciting than the dance. Catch you later, Max. You dance worse than my dad. Yes. As you can tell by my outfit, I, I was in a hurry. Dana, have you seen Nathan around? Hell no, I've been dancing with Trevor. Come on and dance with us. <laughs> Look at Trevor trying to bust a move. It's so wrong. It's so wrong. How's the end of the world going? Great! So this it's has so been wrong. the worst fucking week of my life, so <laughs> I need to act like a carefree student tonight. For Kate. I hear you, Dana. I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him, okay? I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for him. He needs help, but not from his family. What do you know about his dad, Sean Price? Uh, rich. And rich. And a dickhead, according to Nathan. Prescotts can't buy a happy family or a happy club. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. Look at you. Plus, I like hanging with Trevor and his skater friends. No drama. That sounds like a plan, Dana. 
I'm glad Trevor is with me tonight. Thanks. The boy cannot dance, though. Look at that. Can he do this? So I heard they like he hurt his foot. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I Oh, that makes me want to pull a carry on the Vortex Club. Yeah, let me sit my tush down. Kate almost dead. Rachel dead. Rachel dead. <laughs> Enter the Vortex Club. And... Look at these entitled assholes. They don't give a shit about anybody. If that tornado came right now, I would just sit here and watch for a while. But I have to make sure Chloe doesn't go on her own rampage. I mean, she is out. <laughs> that is. I just hate out. feeling this way. <clears throat> Dark and angry. I'm sure you're not the only one. Vortex Club actually hired DJ Doom for the party. Check him out. Uh -uh -uh -uh. I like the sound of music. Oh, there you are. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the locker. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide him. So, you made it. Hey, Mr. Jefferson. Uh, are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that yeah, makes sense. Is. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio. I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, look, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest. It can't be. Before I do, I, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about it. I swear if it, it is. is. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Come on! Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Oh my god! I mean, it's not a complete shocker. I mean, she does good work. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. <laughs> she is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back. Thank you.